Thanks for joining us. We're going to begin with those shots fired in an Atlanta college campus. They've got police desperately searching for a shooter, and we have been following that story all morning long. Today is the first day of classes at the Atlanta University Center, which is Morehouse, Spelman, and Clark University. But just last night, shockwaves moved through the country after four students were shot at their annual block party. We have live team coverage for you this noon. We begin. Well, we have right now CBS 46 is Adam Harding, who is at Grady Memorial Hospital, where the students are actually recovering. But we're going to begin with Daniel Wilkerson, who's live on Clark's campus in the Atlanta's West End. Daniel, police still don't know who these shooters are. Karen, good afternoon. Yes, that's exactly what I was told by a high ranking APD officer just a little while ago. Meanwhile, I was just off the phone with a Clark Atlanta official who tells me right now they are inside discussing this shooting. Freshmen headed to their first class ever on a college campus. But just hours earlier, this was a scene at Clark Atlanta University, a block party. More than 200 students from Clark, Spelman and Morehouse here when two groups start shooting. Four female students are hit. Everyone starts running. This is what we've learned from Atlanta police. Officers say the shooting stemmed from two groups of students arguing. They say the women were not targeted, but got caught in the crossfire. Investigators started right away interviewing witnesses, but say initially not many students would talk. Police then started the process of pulling surveillance footage to gather possible clues. Atlanta police tell me they have no way of knowing just yet whether the shooters were students, nor do they have a description of them. Certainly not the way students want to start a false semester, their thoughts now with their classmates. Back out here live, I'm told a text alert went out to students just before 1 a.m. this morning. Meanwhile, a prayer vigil is scheduled here on campus a little later this evening. Karen. All right, Daniel, thank you so much. Now our